Hello. Wow, this is louder than I've realized. Hello. Welcome to the 4.6 Genshin Impact Arlequino live stream. <laughs> Can you hear me? Is am I he hearable? Am I audible? Hello. Hello. Oh, hello, Noble. Welcome back. Oh my god, Senior's here. Hi, Senior. Hello, Poon. Okay, 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 okay. Self, hello. Pill, hello. Ina, hello. Anya, hello. I put on some Fontaine music. I don't know if you can hear it. It looked like it was really loud at first, though. I think it. I think it is on. It's not very loud, probably. Might have to skip this month's rent. Oh my god, hello, Percy. Not that. Don't do that. Crazy Gamer, hello. Envy, hello. Lychee, hello. Who did I miss? I feel like I missed some someone. Hello, An Anya. No, I said hi, Anya. Good morning, chat. <laughs> Surly. Sylvie, hello. <laughs> Sylvie, hi. Guys, there's a poll. Make sure to answer. It's very important, obviously. 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 I, I, I'm gonna be honest, I always panic when I <laughs> when I start on YouTube because <laughs> there's always a bit of a panic because it does this thing where it says that my OBS is not connected and I was like I don't know how to fix it <laughs> but it, it, it works it's fine everything's working I don't know nothing happened also I'm really loving this image um I really hope this is our banner I'm not gonna lie I will take this banner this uh Family banner? Y'all, I'm screaming! You and me both. <laughs> oh my god, Coco, hello! Hi. Hi. But father, I mean, I get it. So guys, what do you think? Should we do that? Um, sponsored... Sponsorship for... A giveaway for our Likino? What do you guys think? I think that'd be fun, right? It'd be kind of funny. It'd be really cool if this is the banner. Yeah. What are what are y'all hoping to say in four point six? What are your hopes and dreams? It's amazing already. Real father coming home with the kids. Honestly, that would be a banger. This would be a banger. Eh, did. Sure. <laughs> did sure yes. You ready to play? What do y'all want to see? Uh, do you think we'll get like a new, um, what's it called? A uh, new, like, quest line? I hope so. I need our Likino. <laughs> oh, and anyone else after? What about, I'll hate them, Lightji. You can't, you can't do a job interview because of OBS? Oh. Wait, Percy, what? Why would it be affecting? That doesn't make sense. Wait. We got three minutes. You want new artifacts set? For, oh God. Do you guys want to do predictions of what we're going to get? I think we're going to get like uh, a new quest line. And I don't mean like her story. I mean like a new quest line. I think we're going to get... um. What's it called? I, I think we're gonna get new artifacts for sure because we've only had like two, right? Don't make me cry. I can't hear his name. Oh, I'm so sorry. Two cams that are showing. Oh. Percy, yeah, I have no idea what that issue is. I'm so sorry. I wonder if it'll be like her quest or Archon type quest. I think we'll get like, I wanna say like Archon, but maybe not Archon type. Maybe we're, we're, we're gonna get like a quest, but it's gonna be like, a brand new thing like maybe maybe like Dainsdorf style one but maybe it'll be like a brand new thing like a brand new story I think we'll get like a brand new thing I don't know how to describe it like a like a Fatui quest type like imagine they just start like Fatui act one type bullshit oh new area yeah definitely a new area I think I agree with that statement I think this is going to be a very packed stream and if it's not I'm going to be upset Potential Natland crumbs? Uh, yeah. Yeah. I think, honestly, if there is a new, like, quest here, it's gotta be, like, 
something that's geared towards Natlan. Like, they're setting us up, right, for the future. Surely. Surely. I I don't know about Danesliff. I don't know. I, I Well, if they give us both Danesliff and, like, a brand new style of quest, I'll be fine with that. Either, either one is fine. Yeah. One minute left. I'm 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 actually kind of nervous. I don't know why. <laughs> I'm nervous. We're getting a teapot update. Oh yeah, they posted the the dev notes, right? We right. If no Natlan, give us an NPC from Natlan. I think the reason they're not giving us an NPC from Natlan has something to do with the way that Natlan works. So I'm very curious as to what is going on. Why are we not getting a Natlan NPC? I think it's interesting that we're not getting anything so far. <laughs> we might be getting Romeria, the new area. Oh, I see. Oh my god. I don't know why, but this countdown is making me, like, actually so nervous. This countdown is making me nerby. Nerby for real. <clears throat> so, how are y'all doing today? Yeah. <laughs> I feel like I'm- I feel like I'm about to combust. I'm- 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 yes. I need to pause the music. Okay. We've just been listening to Fontaine music in the background. I don't even I don't even know if you can hear it properly. Cause some of it is really loud and some of it is really quiet. You're so nervous. You meet both. This is not normal. I know, I feel like I'm actually like <laughs> hyperventilating. This image is not helping. <laughs> oh my god. Ten seconds. Okay, I'm pausing the music. Everybody shh, everybody shh. Are you pulling for I don't know. Shh, everybody shh. <laughs> Four, three, two, one. <laughs> okay. Oh. Oh, hi. It has been millennia since the fall of Remuria, and its history has oh. long faded into the mists of mythology and superstition. Oh. Legends tell of how before the birth of the Court of Fontaine, there Hello? was an empire known as Remuria. Remuria. Remurians believed their king, Remus, would bring eternal prosperity to the islands of the high sea. However, Her voice, oh my god. The god king's seers prophesied discord. The greatest empire will face the most utter destruction. Lemuria and for this all. is Fortuna. Thus did the god king derive the primordial plan from the cycle of the seven days and winds blowing over sea and land, and composed a splendorous symphony based upon it. He believed that the polities could escape fate's <laughs> judgment we and are. attain eternal paradise if they harmonized with his perfect symphony. Oh my god. But today, welcome to the Genshin Impact version 4.6 special program. No. Let's take a look at the trailer. The breaking the character was On actually occasion, painful. On occasion, we hold barbecue dinners at the house. They hunt for food, compete with each other, even cooperate. They enjoy participating in activities like that, and the feeling is mutual. Best is glitching. After all, it's always possible certain familiar faces will be missing from the crowd the next time a similar event rolls around. Oh. Something has come up, and since oh. it pertains to Cyrus and Sino, I deemed Hi, it essential bestie. to inform you all. It was a <gasps> great plan. Hello? In secrecy. What we is this? We all gathered around and celebrated the revival of our lord. That's how I gained my power. What the is that? The man's been putting the pressure on me. He sent someone to tell me I'm needed for some sort of project. Project Stuja? Participating in the plan will lose a lot of members in the process. But I did not anticipate we would meet again after presenting you with the notes. Nivellet! If you accept my proposal, Monsieur Nivellet, unless absolutely necessary, what is happening here? I will no longer carry out any special missions within Fontaine. What is going on? <gasps> Oh. oh dear god. Oh dear god. Why is she glitching? Transfixed. Everlasting oh. as the moon. Oh, she's so cool. As the moon? Oh my god. An order once given cannot be rescinded. Ooh, who's this? Do you have any idea what you're doing? You're hiding the very person Father has been trying to find. I really didn't mean to drag anyone else into this. If Father finds <gasps> out about this, From everyone me. involved is going to be punished. A traitor. Hello? Sino was chosen, but he Sino. was not the only one. You'd like me to return my power? 
I'm really looking forward to this rite of duels. Hello? The wisdom of Hermanubis would have been ours. Who, who is that? I want you to become the next king of the house. <gasps> you seem to have different ideas. I'm not saying I have all the answers, but doing so will only bring us further away from being a real family. Your no! Words paint an optimistic Hello? Picture indeed. Allow Why are they fighting? You, you among us are willing to sip from a glass oh, filled please. with tainted water. We, I'll make sure it's drained of all impurities and returned Why? to its cleanest form. Good things come to children who do as they're told. So I do hope you decide to tag along. There are what? many dangers ahead. What's going on here? Don't oh shit! Back down. I don't want to disobey an order from father. So why? Why have you backed us into a corner? No demonstration of loyalty shall go unrewarded. No, no way! What is that? What was that? What was that? <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Hello, what everyone. was that? I'm Why is Sarah Ito Miller, here? Why not Sino? Traveler, Lumine. Welcome to oh the Genshin Impact God. version 4.6 special program. <laughs> Hello, Yay, welcome, yeah, yeah, welcome. They're a bit loud, eh? <laughs> okay, so I'm pretty sure that everyone would agree that the House of the Heart Boss isn't Arlequina. an ordinary orphanage. Yeah. But and just in case you needed any convincing, Linny, we from an are fighting. some information with us today. Arlequino? Hey everyone, my name is Erin Avet. I'm the voice of Arlequino, the father of the House of the Hearth. You might also oh. recall that she's a Fatui harbinger known as the Knave. I'm so thrilled to have Smash. been invited to the special <laughs> program. Yeah. Smash. Hi folks, I'm Damon Mills, the voice of Linny, and he's also a member of the House of the Hearth. Smash. Yes, he <laughs> yeah. And although he's not a member Why of the House Ito of the Hearth, here? we've also brought the harbinger of laughter and cheer, the one and only voice of Arataki Ito. <laughs> What up? It's me, Max Middleman. Hey, everybody, what's going on? My bros, my guys, my dudes. Dude, so good. Are you excited to be here? Vibes, vibes, vibes. <laughs> vibes for this. All right, well, without any further delay, let's start introducing the new content from version 4.6. I've heard that travelers will be I'm experiencing in shock. new content I'm actually in the shock. The hearth in the upcoming version. Aaron, why don't you give us a rundown on what sort of organization the House of the Hearth is? Yes, it would be my pleasure. Based on the most recent intelligence Aww. reports, the House of the Hearth is a Fatui intelligence organization Hello. operated by the Knave. The Knave. Uh, it takes in children who no longer have a home due to all manner of reasons, and they receive an education in a variety of disciplines. Naturally, at the same time as it provides a home, the children also take on various responsibilities. Okay, this sounds like everything mm -hmm. that we already know from the game. Uh, is there more news to hear? Yes, everyone knows that the House of the Hearth is a rather complicated orphanage, and the Knave, the fourth harbinger of the Fatui, is Guys, still I'm not hiding okay. the unsolved oh, I'm mystery. Covering Linny. So I'm how sorry, about Linny. we start diving into all the new information that we have about our Lakino? Let's do it. Yeah, yes, let's, do, let's it. do it. Okay, okay. First, I, I, I want to hear it straight from y'all. What kind of person do you think the Knave is? Oh no. Oh my gosh, I'm feeling a lot of pressure right now. <laughs> this is giving me all sorts of deja vu. Let's go on this side. Um, I guess during the Fontaine Archon <laughs> quest, I noticed that Arlequina was really skilled at directing the conversation. Her way of speaking was incredibly refined and polite, but mm -hmm. she was also incredibly intimidating. <laughs> mm -hmm. I'm I the mean, new Linny. Remember how Farina pretended Hi. not to recognize her and talked about having nightmares? Oh. I totally get where she was coming from. Mm. But that's just an outsider's point of view, right? <laughs> What is the knave like as a parent? I think Damon knave. is probably the best oh. person to answer that question. <laughs> okay, take it away. They're okay, so cute. you were hoping that I would be the weakest link? Yeah. Well, <laughs> she's a very strict father. Okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> strict yeah. father. Strict. Um, hmm. All right, it sounds like she gives everyone an intimidating impression. Yeah, but I think Arlequino loves all of the house's children equally, and she would never Surely. treat them harshly for no reason. Of course. Though, the kids feel a lot of pressure during her lessons and are often scared speechless by her stern attitude. Oh, God. It's probably for their own good. In an organization like the Fatui, these Hi. kids actually need to be more mature, tough, and patient than other children who are their age. You know? Mm. I'm not going to lie. That's sad, though, isn't it? It is, yeah. yeah. Who I don't know this knave. I want if I to can know, make it through this. Why are they this way? <laughs> <laughs> that video okay. took me out. <laughs> are you trying to 
say that I'm she actually in shock. Like that because she was traumatized. Ooh, they really okay. did pop off now calling now her that's father. That's very sharp of you, oh, no. but let's keep our Lakino secrets hidden for just a little bit longer. They knew what they were doing. Okay, okay. Um, I you do need a strict question, father. Though. Why did the children call her father? Okay. Ah, well, well, if you're curious about Arlequino's past, then you'll have to find your answer in the game. That's fair. Her story quest, Ignis Purgatorius, will be released with version 4.6. Okay. Now, I don't want to spoil anyone's gameplay experience by saying too much about her quest, okay? But I do hope that travelers will be able to appreciate Arlequino's unique charm after they've experienced her entire story. What does that mean? <laughs> Version you can't a new feature, Hello? the focused experience mode. Ooh. Now, if oh. you use the feature while playing Arlequino's story quest, then it will minimize the number of times that you'll be interrupted by characters or quest locations being allocated to other quests. Mm. So, hopefully, this mode will help travelers have a better story nice. experience. Nice, focused. Know, nice. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. Love and being in focused. The future, this function will become available for more and more quests. Besides okay, the story quest, I'm also looking forward to hearing the Knave's voiceover lines because Aaron's kind of awesome. <laughs> <laughs> we'll finally be able to hear what she thinks about the other Harbingers, too. Yes, I yes. selfishly also think that will be cool. <laughs> I want to yes. hear what she has to say. <laughs> Next, let's take a look at Arlequino's elegant yet deadly fighting style. Oh my. <laughs> Intrigue! <laughs> yeah! Intrigue. Staring into my eyes is ill advised. Is it? I can't promise you'll like what you see. Transfixed. Oh. I want to stare into her eyes. <laughs> I want to stare into her eyes. She can do whatever she likes. This is where you fall. She's so cool. She's so cool. <laughs> <laughs> I like how she glides. Yes. Yes. Yeah, she's very elegant. Like that was a perfect descriptor. Like elegant but deadly. Like a yes, like a ballerina of death. Yes. Ballerina she of does death. So effortless. I know, right? Yes. Angel of death. All right. Well, if we're going to talk about Arlequino's <laughs> combat abilities, then we're gonna have to talk about the bond of life mechanic. Uh, you might have been a victim to it while you were fighting elite Fatui operatives in Fontaine. Right. Does anyone still remember what a bond of life is? Yeah. Yo, wait, are you going to be teaching us about her abilities? Guys, you're too loud. Pipe oh. down. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Let's listen to what she has to say. Wait, I, I think I remember. It's the red portion of the HP bar. When you have a bond of life active, it'll absorb oh. any healing that your character receives. So Interesting. they can't regain HP until the bond of life value has been healed. Yeah. Yes. Right? Oh. Very good, student. <laughs> when Arlequino <laughs> has a bond of life greater than or equal to a certain percentage of her health bar, her normal charged and plunging attacks will be converted to pyro damage, which Ooh. can't be overridden by other elemental infusions. And while Fine. she's in this state, her normal attacks will consume a portion of her current bond of life to deal more damage oh. and reduce the remaining cooldown on her elemental skill. Damn, okay. Whoa, 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 wait, 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 know, a it's a lot, it's a lot. So you're saying that she'll deal more damage with her normal attack when her bond of life is higher? <laughs> Put simply, yes. Whoa, 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 wait a second. <laughs> no, wait, I get it. Wait, so it, it, Arlequino can give herself a bond of life, right? Yeah, I, I think so. I mean, otherwise she'd have to chase down enemies who can put a bond of life on her. <laughs> Actually, that, that sounds kind of funny. <laughs> yes, I'd like to see that. Uh, and that brings us to her elemental skill. Our Lakino skill doesn't just damage enemies. It also applies a blood debt directive to any enemy that it hits, which oh. will damage them periodically. Oh, and when she uses that's a cool. charged attack or her elemental burst, she'll absorb nearby blood debt directives. This also allows her mm. to obtain a bond of life based on the number of directives that she absorbs. Oh, so don't so worry. Can, she's oh, stealing their concerned. HP too. <laughs> I know you are. Okay, hold on. She's consuming she can't them. She regain HP until her bond of life is removed, right? So, how does she stay in the fight? Well, after dishing out damage, Arlequino's elemental burst will reset the cooldown of her elemental skill and heal her based on her attack and her current bond of life. Oh, okay. Also, thanks to one of her talents, while oh. Arlequino is in combat, she gains bonus pyro damage, but also cannot be affected by any healing effects other than the healing provided by her burst. 
play. Oh, oh my so god, her that, glitching that out. Like she's as ruthless to herself yeah, as she yeah. is to her mm. enemies. Like she needs therapy, probably. <laughs> she needs therapy. <laughs> she's kind of a savage. I mean, <laughs> um, right. So Arlequino even has a special kind of movement whenever she uses her charged attack, mm. right? Ooh, that was perfect <gasps> for scaring her enemies. Yes. Yeah, and oh my for God. putting some serious pressure on them. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> what is that? Uh huh. Oh, it's about time to introduce the event wishes in version 4.6. You guys ready? Ooh, let's yeah. do it. So exciting. All right. During the first phase of version 4.6, Arlequino Holy. and Linny will both enjoy a drop rate Holy. boost. Holy. The all new five star polearm Crimson Moon semblance will also become available. Jesus. Also, the Wanderer and Baiju will return. Wanderer and phase, Baiju. So be sure to keep an eye out. Yay. Oh my gosh, that's, that's so a amazing. lot of fatusi. <laughs> okay, so Aaron that's a whole fatusi right there. Do you have any other news you'd like to share? <gasps> Actually, I do. Let's discuss the new weekly boss. Oh, that's yeah. right. We were just talking about how the knave shows different faces to her family members and to outsiders. Wait, but no in Furina. special circumstances, she will reveal another side. Guys. <laughs> That's right. No Furina. Are you ready to see a new name? Yes. Oh. I am ready. So ready. 4.6 No Furina. Oh. S Seriously, she looks so good. Holy. Holy. Oh my god, this looks amazing. She looks amazing. Those threads, what are those threads? Oh, look at that. Oh, we're getting absolutely wrecked in this fight. Holy. She is so cool. Hello. What is that? The music. The music goes so hard. Hello. Wow. Not even Linny and Fremen have like seen this side of her before. True. So the knave is accepting challengers now? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my gosh. She's so elegant, but also super duper dangerous. Yeah. She's so yeah. <laughs> Terrifying. I love her. Even more badass with she Twice is badass. Badass attitude. <laughs> hey, it's not so simple to see the name's other bad side. Attitude. She'll appear normally at first, as if she were giving you an ordinary training lesson, waiting to counter your attacks. Yeah. What is this team? Like dodge all of our attacks like a Is this her, her team for when we play against yeah. her? Like, you know? It feels like she's implying oh, she that we're all in the Same. palm of her hand. <laughs> I mean, you guys know what her personality is like. Mean, she doesn't mean. want her children <laughs> crying or running away from conflict. Instead, she hopes that they'll be able to take the initiative, even if their opponent is their own father. The outside world will not show her children mercy, so neither can she afford to be too forgiving to them. Hmm. If you do Holy not shit. repay the blood debt directives the knave applies to you, all her attacks against you will be enhanced. But... <sighs> If she you can one shot to us. Heal the bond of life. The knave will reward you for repaying this blood debt, and your charged attacks against her will be enhanced. Oh, uh, don't the bone wings on her back look like spiders? She has sorry. a freaking laser. Oh, yes, that's it. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's like she has total control of her prey while she watches them struggle and closes the distance. She's hot. <laughs> oh, kind of creepy being She's the hunted hot. one for once. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I think we should stop the introduction here. <laughs> Let's leave some space for everyone to experience the challenge for themselves. Wait, so I know that many travelers will be wondering about this. Holy. The Nave's boss form is tied to her story quest. Mm -hmm. Normally, players would have to progress the story to a certain point in order to participate in the challenge. But so it's her now story we have quest. A quick challenge feature for weekly Trounce domain bosses. Yeah. Ooh. As long as travelers are adventure rank 40 or higher, they'll be able to challenge her directly by going to the adventurer handbook, going to the domains tab, selecting Trounce domains, and pressing quick challenge. Wow. Oh, that's cool. That's a yeah. nice little shortcut to the battle. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> that is really valuable information to have. <laughs> and this it also is looks like it's my turn to deliver some news. The Two second new Archon. Will like story quest, basically. 
fragment oh. of harmonic Ooh. whimsy and unfinished reverie. Travelers who are interested wait, in that should cool. stay tuned for more information. Cool. Oh, you're finished. Okay, wait, how come your update was so short? It wasn't enough for me. Yeah, give us more. Okay, okay, I actually do have other news to share. Ooh. Ooh. Yes, 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 yes. In version 4.6, Sumeru City will be experiencing an unsolved mystery. Ooh. And for some reason, Sino's gotten mixed up in it. Hey, how did you know oh. about that? It, his picture is right there. Oh, oh right. <laughs> Oops. He's so well, cute. Well, Sino wanted to investigate personally because someone involved in the case has a very unique identity, and the two of them share a close connection. Uh oh. Sounds like there's some serious shenanigans going That's on. That's right. Is this a case where we get to use violence if the situation gets too complicated? Violence. These are all very good guesses. But I'll offer you one clue that you probably wouldn't be able to guess otherwise. A mysterious youngster with connections Ooh. to the mystery will make his debut during the case. Who's this? And Sino's friends are not just freeloaders who only show up for food. <laughs> Tainari, Kale, Alhatham, and Kave will all come and to support Kave? Him he's in a pinch. They specifically so, said yeah, and if Kave. You want to know more about what happens in this case, <laughs> then be sure to check out Sino's second story quest, Lupus Arius Act Two. They really had Travelers to say can that. Travelers venture to Sumeru and investigate the secrets lurking underneath the sands. New Sino in story time, quest. Of course. <laughs> Sarah, you totally delivered. That was great news. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Speaking of great news, Ooh. I think Damon also has wait. some important information to share. Wait, 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 wait. Really? Wait, yes. wait, wait. What are we wait. waiting for? We've just presented too much information too quickly. C can, we, can we take a break, please, so we can digest <laughs> all of it, please? Oh, Damon. please, please. He can't keep getting away I with this. Do <laughs> go. Right. No, no, Damon, you're right. I'll hate them. Cafe. Let's check out the first redemption code Tainari before Sino. we continue introducing the new content. And Kole. And Kole. That's what I thought. And Kole, <laughs> if you care. Oh, I'm in the quiet of the thing. There you go. I don't know how I feel so far. Not great. Not great. I don't feel great. I'm not okay with this. I want a refund. I'm being bullied. Color isn't important. Oh, not that. Here, do you want me to write it down? W T K B. Wait, is this the first one? This is the first one. W T K B M B D eight Z Z R. -Z -R. You guys realize we don't have Furina rerun. No Furina rerun. Basically, Arlequino is the new Archon. Confirmed. Like, instead of getting a second Furina story quest, we're getting Arlequino. Do you realize? Hey, welcome back, everyone. Oh, I'm so hey. We've already told you the story of Arlequino and the House of the Heart. That's so crazy. Why don't we continue the story of Remuria, which yeah. you saw in the beginning continue. of the program? I would like this very much, please. You and yes, me both. You did such yes, a good job. Yes. Encore! Encore! <laughs> new area showcase. A new area of Fontaine will open in version 4.6. Travelers will get to visit the village of Petricor. Ooh. Petricor. <gasps> Though, would there Petricor. Be to see on such a small island? Well, yeah, I guess this is, this is where I'm supposed to really confidently say totally, right? It is, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, now that you've mentioned it, there's definitely more to this village than meets the eye, right? Yeah, I think we're focused on the wrong thing here. Oh. This is where the kingdom of Remuria's remains lay at rest. So That's how so big true, was Bill. such a glorious and prosperous nation, really? Mm. Oh, well, now that you say that, is that a I mean, cat? this little town looks a whole lot bigger. Why is there a cat now, in the water? that's a neat trick. <clears throat> anyway, <laughs> this is where we'll meet a talking cat. With its guidance, we'll oh. be able to see the civilization that vanished a talking thousands cat. of years ago. <gasps> Oh my gosh, uh, that's amazing! Anything for a talking cat. Aww. <laughs> As Aaron mentioned at the beginning of the program, Kitty. King Remus composed a symphony, one with wondrous power that grants the wishes of the human souls dwelling within. Yes, I'm getting it. Kitty. I'm getting it. I'm. I. I actually. I don't You're get it. You're so not getting it. Much okay. related to music. <laughs> in a few words, so you'll just have to learn about the symphony by going on an adventure with this little cat. I'll avoid Aww. spoiling the adventure itself, but you'll arrive at the Remuria Ooh. ruins with the cat. The kingdom's remnants slumber in the depths Ooh. where the sunlight can't reach. 
you'll meet a dragon in the deep seas. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. So you'll be able to obtain powers relating to the symphony, which will help you explore the lost realm of Remuria. You'll nice. be able to pause the melody within the realm of this ancient civilization. That looks you can cool. also unseal time in places where it stopped. Man, this so looks these cool. powers will let you interact with specific objects in the ruins. You know, that might be useful for books. solving puzzles during your adventure. Totally. Oh, holy shit. Meanwhile, a forgotten statue sits in a recess of the faded castle, silently proclaiming the immortality and glory of a great civilization. Oh. It awaits a warrior who would dare challenge the majesty of the ancient ruler. Oh, yeah, that's right. The statue of marble and brass will soon be coming as a boss. You can earn all sorts of materials if you manage to beat it in a challenge. Yeah. I'm so hyped for it. <laughs> Me oh, too. my gosh, yes. And Damon, you did such a great yes, job with introducing it. That was great. <laughs> that was great, yeah. Damon. Wait, but real quick, quick question. Yeah. How do we even get to such a remote little island? That is a great question. Travelers who have already completed the third act of the Archon Quest, mm -hmm. Song of the Dragon and Freedom, will automatically <gasps> unlock a teleport waypoint in the village of Petrichor. Hopefully this helps travelers with exploring the new area. Oh, I heard that this feature Our ditto's getting filled in areas in the future. Uh, so exciting. I know. So our cool. ditto's getting filled. All right, that's all the information that we have about I could take him out oh, for now. The new boss now, for I guess our Likino. <laughs> <laughs> it seems like a new style of rock and roll is getting popular in Inazuma. Rock and roll. Yeah. <laughs> In the Zuma right, rock and roll. take a short break before we get into the next section. Oh, they're take already taking a on the break. Second redemption code. Hello? Yeah. All right. Oh, well, that was quick. Um, yeah, sure. Another code. Here we go. The ditto's getting filled, y'all. You've only done act two. Oh, well, hop to it, bestie. Hop to it. Get to work. Time to open the game and, uh, you know walk through that real quick or don't that's okay I guess you can probably get there some other way is that why Ido's here yeah we're getting an Ido event again isn't this the second Ido event in like the last two patches I'm actually kind of tired of seeing Ido <laughs> I'm done with seeing Ido <laughs> why is he here Not the slayage. I don't want more Ito. Welcome back, oh, everyone. God. Hey. Okay, I hear that a musical tour is coming to Inazuma, and the organizer is none other than Arataki Ito himself. <laughs> Hello. Max, would you like to tell us more about it? It would be my absolute pleasure, compadre. What so is that? I got a question. Does everyone still remember Dvorak? Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Of course. He participated in last year's Lantern Rite, mm -hmm. right? That's oh, right, yeah. Both Hu Tao and Xin Yan performed mm -hmm. there. Mm -hmm. That's Ooh. right, and this time, it's an epic tour for the ages, organized by none other than Ito and Dvorak. Oh, oh my gosh, and even the concert name bruh. sounds really epic. Yeah, oh, yes. For real, no, bro. He says, iridescent, arataki, rock and oh my god, Hazo! Hazo mentioned. Hazo and Cookie! <laughs> and the theme of this concert is about life. Specifically, Welcome back. It's about a brave puppy who puppy. saved the lives of countless other creatures on the battlefield. Aww. First ever so Guru. Cute. Adorable. I'm really yeah. looking forward to yeah. it. Yeah, me too. I really hope the Music Festival of Life will inspire everyone to unleash their own rock and roll spirit. Yeah. And I'll mm -hmm. let you in on a little secret. Ito himself will personally be performing on the big stage. Wow. What? Ooh. Oh my gosh, that's going to be awesome. <laughs> yes, it will be. And here's more exclusive news for you. Dvorak will be giving away a oh. brand new musical instrument to our oh. travelers called the Nightwind Horn. Ooh. We're getting a horn. So if you enjoy playing music in real life, or especially if you enjoy playing music in the game, be sure to check it out. Yay, I'm horn. I'm more amazing performances from all the great musicians out there. Can't oh, wait yeah. to get a horn. Well, since you're so excited about it and the festival, why don't you help launch the Arataki Rockin' for Life Tour to Force of Awesomeness? Oh, it's in <laughs> Kokomi's Island, too. Right, there's three steps to preparing for the festival. Number oh. one. It's music Extreme game. Carnival ensemble. Let's go, music game. Some rhythm games while the stage is still coming together. We love a rhythm game. Really unique. Yeah, 
they really are. And the second task is called the Trillion Trinket Trawl. Mm. Say that three times fast. The Trillion Trinket Trawl, the Trillion Trinket Trawl, the Trillion Trinket Trawl. I did it. Ooh. We can't have <laughs> a rock and music festival without a rock and venue. So travelers will be helping Dvorak spruce it up with his list of items. It's a piece of cake, right? Yeah. <laughs> no Miss Hina Van and lastly, <laughs> we have the Meeting of Melodies. Can't have a party without adoring fans, so we gotta invite fellow music lovers to come jam with us. After listening to their tunes, we can restore the missing music notes. Oh, oh wait, that's so cool. We'll be able to hear them sing. That is super exciting. Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Yes, that's the point. Music gets you pumped. And after we've rocked out to the pure spirit of music awesomeness in Inazuma over in Mondstadt, we'll be dancing to a tense and thrilling tune. <gasps> hold Ooh. up, hold up. Ooh. What do you mean by tense and thrilling? Does it mean anything if I say. Wind Trace, Seekers and Strategy has finally arrived. Yes. Oh. I love Wind Trace. We're getting and, Wind and Trace. Yeah, it can get a little tense at times. <laughs> well, the, the new name implies that the game has undergone some mechanics changes, yeah? Yeah, Seekers and Strategy. That's very intuitive of you. Thank yeah, you. you'll be playing hide and seek as rebels and hunters, just like before, but there are a few new rules. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, when rebels are captured for the first time, they'll be exiled to the surveillance zone for a short period of time. Now, they will be automatically freed after their time out, but also their friends can try to help them escape the zone early. Oh. But if you get sent to jail twice, you're permanently deleted from the game. <gasps> oh, that does sound tense. Hello, <laughs> deleted from the <laughs> That's game? Not at all. Oh no, each round will have six signaling devices, which will prevent nearby rebels from disguising or concealing themselves. The rebel's goal is to repair these devices while also avoiding capture. So this Once is DBD and Genshin. They win the match. Oh, and rebels can work together to repair these devices. It's, it's and Dead by Daylight, but Genshin. You have to, the have to fix Jennies. The signaling devices Guys, we have to fix Jennies. <laughs> if you team up with friends, then watching these games should be a blast. Okay. Ah, she gets it. She gets it. <laughs> But the next part is even more thrilling. Can't wait to do this just as, device, uh, you know, Arlequino for the most What does it mean? It means it'll give weird. off a light visible by every Literally player. playing DVD. In fact, the device will even be marked on the mini map. This is Ooh, literally okay. DVD. So that means that repairing the devices will expose your location. No way. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's these Guys, gotta fix the Jenny. We're gonna lose. Fix Jenny. Mm -hmm. It's literally even four gens. That's actually oh, really funny. And in another event, travelers will oh. receive a rather strange commission. What okay, what is this? Can't wait to finally play DVD. What I mean is, there's a chef who's for famous for using unusual ingredients. Who's this? And he wants to make friends with a pyro regisfine. Oh. Huh? What? Oh yeah. And not just a pyro regisfine, he also wants to befriend a primo geovision. And um, a jade plume terror shroom. Is and okay? a millennial pearl seahorse. Uh, <laughs> you guys heard me the first time. Yeah, I thought you would react this way. Anyway, a chef recently returned from a trip to Natlon, and he started getting some oh. ideas. He thought he should Natlan. toughen himself up by Mentioned. having his own companion. You know, just like how people from Natlon have Saurian companions. That makes Natlan. sense. Natlon. Mentioned. <laughs> kind of. Wait. Natlon. Mentioned. Did you say that he came back from Natlon? Listen, listen, Damon. If you want to oh, know the okay, details, okay. go check out the event <laughs> when the virgin is I'm live, sorry. all right? But for now, it's time for me is to he on the game club. Oh, okay, all right, all right. Okay, okay, here you go. All right, you got it. <laughs> you got In it. In this challenge, you can adjust the difficulty and your negotiation strategies. Oh, if you've got I see. The guts, then you can take on fearless difficulty. I oh, see, I see. You can also talk to Ranjit to adjust the number of negotiation strategies. So if you reduce them, it amps up the challenge difficulty, giving you the perfect opportunity to test your skills. Cool. Both active Playing with strategies randoms? and long you mean win strategies trace? are available. We can play together on stream. Strategies at will. We can do it in However, your opponent's uh, HP EU and, and level will change etc. depending on Why are they saying it not lawn? I couldn't tell you. Isn't yeah. it not lawn? So you've got to choose your favorite strategies to come out on top. Play to your strengths. Wow. No okay. Tip. And moving on, travelers oh. should be familiar with our next Vibro event. Crystals. Vibro Crystal Applications. Ooh, it seems like the event involves connecting different vibrating crystals in order to generate different effects. Aaron, I am so impressed by how intuitive you are. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that means that so is much incredible. coming. <laughs> yeah, well, I meant it. 
Each round requires two teams. Oh. Before each battle, you can set up vibro crystal harmonics plans for each of your teams. This will allow you to receive different combat what a team. buffs when you combine transmitter crystals and receiver crystals. Oh, this thing again. Basically, the transmitter crystal decides the trigger <laughs> condition. <laughs> this thing the again. The receiver crystal determines the buff that your team gets as a result. By connecting them okay. in different combinations, you so can many create primos. varying harmonic effects. Real. It's your custom buff plan. Wow. Spot on, Sarah Cruz. Why is he <laughs> flirting with everything? You gain a harmonic no, I don't know. For each time that you trigger a harmonic effect, <laughs> you can get even more combat bonuses Not if you ew. accumulate enough harmonic points. Each challenge will have different trial characters, oh. so you can choose the harmonic buff that works best for your team setup. Nice. Be sure to maximize your points if you want to exchange them for rewards. Next. Mm -hmm. Nice. Also, the Genius Invocation TCG oh, event, TCG the Forge Realms Temper, will be returning in version 4.6. Yes. The Heated Battle Mode will also receive an update, so don't miss out, <laughs> duelists. <laughs> And Cookie there's going to be an Carson. overflowing mastery event, Ooh. so you can more easily mastery. train up the characters who need the extra boosty boost. <laughs> Let's oh my go. gosh, thank you so much, Max. <laughs> I'm you not just doing did all that. an amazing yes. job. That was impressive. Thank you, Sarah. Mm -hmm. In place TCG, and I don't know. you introduced so many events in one go, I feel like you deserve a little break. Ooh, look at her. You know what? Oh. I, so yes, pretty. You agree? I was gonna well, say I agree too. So <laughs> the code should be in Discord. Uh, Let's check senior. out the. The, the last, last redemption, redemption code. code! Yay! <laughs> Yay! Um, how are you guys feeling about this live stream? Because I went from excited to... I don't know. The only good thing about this so far is, like, the two story quests. I didn't think they'd be story quests. I thought we would get, like, a new quest quest. I was excited. But whatever, I guess. Guess I'll take the Arlequino story quest gladly. I'll take that. Mm-hmm. Encino. I'm excited about that. I don't know. Aside from that, it's just a bunch of events. It's uh, not as much as I thought we would be getting. But hey, we got a new area, so that's nice, I suppose. Did I write this right? I was writing in the code. Okay. Is that, is that right? Gonna try and see if we're Baiju. Underwhelming. A Welcome little bit, yeah. Back, everyone. Oh. Next up, we're presenting some information about improvements for oh, different in-game systems. Nice. Ooh. First, uh, we have some updates for the Serena teapot, such as the quick obtain feature. Instead of having to navigate oh, a bunch of menus, you can use this Finally. Finally. Oh my god. I'll actually use the teapot. I'm actually gonna use the teapot Ooh, for once. Thank does you. Sound very convenient. So convenient, <laughs> so convenient. Jesus the Christ. Will also be updated so you'll be able to use more portraits of your familiar friends as your profile display. <gasps> okay. Oh, new oh, avatars. That mask is Hanachiru Sato, isn't it? Mhm. Mm Oh, and there's Arama. You're right, there's Softy. The Thunderbird and uh -huh. Rue, uh, and more. This is amazing. So <laughs> many more. I'm sure lots of travelers. Oh my like God, Treasure compasses have also been updated. Treasure compass Its update. Will be displayed on both the large map and the main Oh, map. now it shows the you exactly. Will also include information about different map layers. You got Kazuo's sword. Way more yeah. intuitive. Oh no, it's I'm so sorry. It's time to eradicate all the maps with 99% exploration progress. Heck yeah. yeah. Yay! Eradication! Woo. Yes. Eradication! Now that we've gone over some updates to the game systems, it's time to talk about some Genshin Impact soundtrack news. <laughs> Soundtracks. Let's go, music! Yeah, <laughs> that's right. Genshin Impact's third Fontaine OST, Kansas third Fontaine. Eternus, <gasps> will debut Lalo. during version Lalo, you missed it. Six. This it's album over. features original music created by the Hoyo Mix team for the new region Lalo. of Fontaine and related content. Lalo, hello. Yes. Hey. Music is my favorite. So <laughs> oh no, y'all. It looks like there's nothing left for us to present. <gasps> I know, I know. Yes. So... I think that means it's time for this special program to come to a close. Say it's not so. Is, is there anything else that y'all would like to share with ooh, all the ooh, travelers ooh, who ooh, are watching? Yes. Uh, what? Uh, we need to have Ven answer uh, right now in this moment. Um, it's okay. You've got now. this. Okay. You've got this. Uh, okay. Okay. I'll make go. it easy and just um, be very selfish and say that I'm 
just so incredibly there excited we go for our fixed Latino. it me um, too we did we did a lot i'm of very excited with her. i think she's really cool and i can't wait for everyone else to see how cool she is you're yes, so right she's so, cool. yeah, totally. she's so freaking cool and i she love is so cool. the whole quest and everything secret that i can't talk about right now <laughs> but i am also really excited for that and Linny's involvement in said things you and me both and that's all I'm gonna say Honestly, right now, the guys. only thing saving yeah, this is so hard is to talk about this without spoiling anything, but I'm so Arlequinus so Quest with Linny's appearance, this concert Fremenet and Lynette, so good. and then Sino story. I had more fun recording for this uh, part Honestly. of the Genshin Impact than I've had. I would dispense time. all of these oh, like events God, apart from like Wind Trace. <laughs> I'm excited about well, Wintrace. I'm excited for all of those things too, and I'm also really pumped for the Wintrace Festival because I love it so much. <laughs> and it sounds like there's a ton of awesome things coming in version 4.6, so I hope everyone's excited. Yes. I like the uh, yeah. quality of life updates too, well, okay. especially with the teapot and say, stuff. There's so some fun. others that I'd rather Being have, but it's fine. So <laughs> we'll, we'll take we'll take what we can. Time. Thanks for being here. And His first quest was really interesting, but I guess it so won't be interesting if you don't care. In game. See you guys Bye. In the game. Bye. Bye. Have a good Bye. rest of your days, Bye. fellas. So, thoughts? Leslo, you're looking at this and you're probably like, what the hell is this image, right? So we're basically getting um, another concert style event. And Dvorak is back. And this is going to be an Inazuma one. And we have a rhythm game. We have like three fighting games. We have Wind Trace. They basically put all of the events possible into this patch. That's it. That That's it. And two story quests. That's the whole thing. We have a new area, but apparently it's basically all underwater and it's all tied to one quest. One world quest. I'm assuming. So, yeah, that was definitely less than what I thought it would be. Um, no Furina rerun. No Furina second story quest. Oh, we're getting DBD. They've changed the wind trace to basically be DBD. You have to fix generators, basically, literally. Uh, yeah, I d they're rerunning Scaramouche with Baiju. For some strange reason. Um, yeah, that's a that's Shenhan nowhere to be seen. Uh Arlequino Weekly Boss. Uh Arlequino's weekly boss is tied with Arlequino's story quest. And Arlequino's, I'm assuming, the boss that she uses, the new like horseman, uh weird statue man, I'm pretty sure is tied to the quest that you the world quest so there will be like the quick feature the, the quick access feature and that's it are you getting baiju i will probably try to but it's a good thing he's after i'll, I'll try my best but I, I might have to not because chlorine if they skip if they uh drip market chlorine i don't know i don't know i don't know i don't know like i don't know it's it's looking rough right now it's it's looking rough I did promise that I would try, but I, I might try just because I did promise Aichi. I'll at least try it. We do get a new artifact set as well. Yeah. I thought they were going to show the regional b banner for this pack. No regional banner. That's going to a, a good a good point, Aichi. I'm going to assume that we're going to get a regional banner, if not next patch, 4.8. New sumo boy, so cute. True. Why would you need Baiju? I promised Lychee that I would go for Baiju. But it was because I said, if I clear your abyss. <laughs> I, I said to Lychee, if I clear your abyss with Baiju, I'll get Baiju. And I, you know, shot myself in the foot there. <laughs> Why wouldn't she? She's great. Help. I thought there would be a new banner type thing, but no. No, I, my guess is if we don't get the new banner type thing next, like 4.7... We'll probably get it for 4.8 and it will just be a complete rerun banner. It wasn't a promise. I was more making a joke. And and then I did it very quickly because uh, Lychee's Baiju is absolutely amazing. And yeah. Oh, yes, he is so great. 
I mean, lychees is really great. Yeah. I love lychees baiju and that's about it. But yeah, I don't know how I feel about this uh, 4.6. I'm actually a little bit... Uh, Percy put it best. Underwhelmed is definitely... I was expecting a bit more. Um, I think Arlequino is literally carrying this on her back. Actually carrying this patch on her back. Um, that's all I've got. <laughs> I don't know. I was expecting a little more pizzazz. I think the fact that there's another Ito event has actually soured this entire patch for me. I like They're making me dislike him with how much of him we get every time. Yours won't be as good, so don't bother. That is a good point, to be honest. Bye, Bill. Have a good sleep. But, you know, honestly, if... I I literally can't stand... I, I can't with another Ito event. There's so many, like, characters in, in Inazuma. Why does it have to be him? We just had a Beetle event. I swear. I, I've actually had enough of Ito. The amount of Ito they give us is making me dislike him more. <laughs> I know he was just on the banner or whatever, but Jesus Christ. Way too much Ito. Too much Ito. Ito was like, yeah, too much. It's too much. It's too much. Is one made for Arlikino? I'm, assu I'm assuming too. Yeah, I, I'm assuming. You love him, but they went overboard. It's not Genshin Impact anymore. It's Gen Shito Impact. Shito ever. I don't know. I'm a little bit disappointed about that a concert thing. I don't know. I I don't know. I would have rather they did the concert in Sumeru. And then we, I would have rather had double Sumeru. Like, I would have just had... I would have been happier with more Sumeru. I think I just love Sumeru, guys. And ever since we left Sumeru, it's just not been the same. <laughs> they done gatekeep the artifacts. They didn't even tell us about the artifacts set. They just showed it and left. They didn't explain what they were. They just like shut up about them. They were like, oh, here's some new artifacts. And that's it. Done. Genshito. It's literally Genshito impact. I don't know, chat. I don't know. This one's a rough one. But hey, we had fun watching together. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, I... Yeah. <laughs> you miss your people. You and me both. I mi I miss Sumeru so much. I love Sumeru. Anyway, we'll probably be doing the Arlequino giveaway. The thing is, if we do an Ar a guaranteed Arlequino giveaway, we will most likely have to reach quite a high goal because to guarantee Arlequino, it's like quite a, a large sum. So we would have to hit a lot of those goals. Um, we we can have a look. Uh, I'll probably put more details about it uh, in Discord. And we can, like, talk about what game. Where are the skins? There's no skins. I don't know who keeps talking about skins, guys. There's no skins. I don't know where you're getting that from. It's all a lie. <laughs> no skins. If we're getting a skin, it'll probably be, like, 4.8 or something. I doubt it's now. We will need to play a silly game. Yeah, we will need to play a silly game if you want to get yourself... A chance of winning a free Arlequino. Obviously, if we do do the sponsorship, we will do lots of other giveaways like uh, battle passes and Balkans and things. Because, um, you know, it's it, it would be mostly for, for, for stream for us as a community to have fun with. But, um, yeah. I am excited for Sino's story quests. I'm only excited for the story quests. So I don't know how I feel. But, yeah. <laughs> Who needs a Goro? You don't really want him. I, you don't have him. I feel like you won't even do the story, the, the quest, but yeah. You want to add him to collection. Oh, I feel like that's not enough for you to do that. But, you know, thanks for watching with me. Um, I'll be back on, uh, let's see, Tuesday next week. Oh, yeah, Tuesday next week. Um, We'll probably maybe play some, I don't know, maybe we'll play more Hanka hang, hang next week. Um, maybe we'll play the, we'll probably be doing the, if we do the, what's it called? The sponsorship, we'll be playing that silly game. Thank you for the stream. Thank you for being here. Um, it's, yeah, it's been, it's been a stream. I don't know. Uh, this one was a bit of a miss. I'm gonna be completely honest. We could start the sponsorship. Do you guys want to do just, we could do it. And then we could like have like an event in discord where we like all like start it. The thing is, 
if anyone participates, you just have to use the link so that it counts. Like for the download or whatever. Honksy! Yeah, we love some Honksy. But yeah, thanks for being here. It was a lot of fun. Um, you know, check Discord for information regarding uh, the, the sponsorship. And I'll uh, leave you and love you and see you next, uh, next, uh, next, uh, I guess, next uh, live stream. Because we're only on YouTube for live stream. <laughs> And uh, yeah, don't forget to come check us out on twitch.tv slash pinkyons. What game is it? Um, right now, the only like game that I've kind of looked into quite a lot is the Star Trek one. Because the Star Trek one, it seems the most, I guess, normal. But I'll go and have a look now and kind of make a decision, I suppose. And I'll put the details in Discord after this. But yeah, thank you all for watching. We can we can uh, all hang out in Discord later on. Bye. See you all later. Love you. Uh, bye.